Hi Sprouts. For writing today, we're gonna to continue to work on our how-to book for something to do over the summer. So I went ahead and pulled out my how-to writing page from yesterday with my two ideas. And I'm gonna to choose to write about having a picnic because that's what I wanna write about. So I'm going to circle idea one so that I remember that that's what I'm gonna work on. Now, I'm going to use my planning map to try and help me to plan out my how-to book. Now, you'll see we have a lot of bubbles. The first one says supplies needed, which thankfully we already worked a little bit on yesterday. Then it says first, then closing, finally, next. We're actually only going to do three of our steps, so we are going to cross out then and closing. So we can cross those out. If you wanna challenge yourself and add some extra steps into your book, you can leave these in, but I'm only gonna focus on three. So I'm gonna go ahead and cross out, then cross out, closing. I don't wanna do those ones. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna start by writing the supplies that we need. Now, I kind of did this on my how-to writing page yesterday, and I said to have a picnic, you need food and a blanket. So I can go ahead and put that right in my bubble. I'm not gonna use a full sentence today because these are pretty small, but I will put one word on each line. So for supplies needed for my picnic, I'm going to need a blanket. I'm going to need a picnic basket. Now on my planning page from yesterday, I put that I need food, but today I wanna to be a little bit more specific with what I would want in a picnic. So not just food, I might want a sandwich and carrots. So for my very first bubble, my supplies needed a blanket, a picnic blanket or a picnic basket, a sandwich and carrots. Now if you have more things that you need, you can put them on this side here. If not, they'll fit right in this bubble. So now we're gonna move on to the next bubble which says first. So what is the first thing that I wanna tell people if I'm telling them how to have a picnic? So the first thing that I want them to do is pack up all of their picnic stuff. They need to put their blanket, they need to put their sandwich, they need to put their carrot in the picnic basket. So first, pack up picnic basket with blanket, sandwich, and carrots. So the first thing you need to do if you're gonna have a picnic is to pack up your picnic basket with blankets, sandwich, and carrots. So now I'm gonna move into this next bubble. It actually says next. So next, once people have their picnic basket packed up, what's step number two if I'm gonna have a picnic? Well, next, hmm, they need somewhere to eat. Next, take your picnic basket to a park. So step number one, pack up everything in your basket. Step number two, in this bubble, take your picnic basket to a park. Now I'm writing really small because these are really small bubbles and I know that that can be tricky. So if you can't fit all of your words in this bubble, you can do two things. The first thing is you can keep writing in this bubble since we're not gonna use it. The second thing would be to either write on the sides or write on the back of your paper. That's up to you. So the first step, pack everything up. Second step, take my picnic basket to a park. Now the last one says finally. So the last thing you wanna do if you're gonna have a picnic, the third step would be to unpack everything and eat. Finally, unpack basket and eat. Again, I didn't do a full complete sentence because this is a small bubble, but that's okay. Finally, unpack basket and eat. So we did our supplies that we need, first step, Second step, third step. Supplies first, next, finally. Now it's your turn. See what three steps you need for your activity over the summer. If you're having a movie night, you need your movie. You need a place to watch it. You Maybe you need snacks. If you're playing a board game, you need the game. You need a place to play your game and you have to play the game. Come up with those three steps and I can't wait to see what you do. Bye.